about uh, 75 yards away is another old dam. So what we did is we dug a little bit of a hole into the back of it so it's pretty weak. Got that charge sitting over there. I'll show you what it is. And then uh, set her in there and shoot it from the far side and see how it goes. So we're, the water level to the there would be what, eight feet difference to where the water is sitting at? The dam is about three feet thick right here. Augered the hole right in here with an old auger and tried to get the charge set in there. We'll show you in a second when we put it in. Okay, everybody, so we got our uh, little three and a half pounds of tan right we stuck in some ABS pipe with a three and a half inch in the bottom, so there's a little more charge in the bottom. Set her down in the dam and then we'll go across over there and do a shot. So this is where we'll put it in. See what happens. Hopefully, it's in there deep enough and hard enough and far enough to. Do the damage. Either way, it'll be fun. We know that much. Well, we'll go across. Okay, you got a couple paddles set up there, a little bit of a bipod. And let me get centered on the thing before you shoot. Two white sticks just below center of screen. Go ahead. Woo! Ah, that's a nice sound. Fire. That only took forever, eh? <laughs> Do you hear the stuff land in the bush? Yeah. <laughs> nice. It's blowing now. Well, that's good. That was an explosion, yeah. <laughs> That's a nice sound. Fire. <laughs> that only took forever, eh? <laughs> Do you hear the stuff land in the bush? Yeah. <laughs> nice. It's blowing now. Well, that's good. That was an explosion, yeah. <laughs> Well, let's go see the damage. Hopefully there's a lot of it. Hey, well, we got a hole in here anyway. That's what I was just thinking, how deep is that sucker? 930, yeah, it is, so. The highest part is that deep, man, so we did okay, I think, as far as all. Yeah. Make it a little bit bigger. I would say right now on the base of the dam, it's 10 feet across at least, three, four feet deep. So, we got a little bit of the, uh, there's the fans, wave again. These are some of my fans, they pay a subscription just to be here. It's interesting, when you watch a beaver pond start to drain down, all the bubbles in the water, all the rotting vegetation starts to make it look like there's something churning around. We saw a beaver when we were trying to shoot it, he was in behind us, right in the middle of the daylight. It didn't seem to bother him any, but we haven't seen one since, but to get the water knocked down, he's got about a 160, 200 acres of flooded land here, and you can get a little bit more manageable would be good. So, in the meantime, happy birthday to everybody whose birthday it is, and uh, make good choices.